hi guys welcome to my channel this video is going to be so quick that you won't even know it was a review <laughs> all right so i got i just got solamente all the perform from maison alhambra and when i got this it was kind of positioned as a dupe of one of the dolce and gabbana the one or the only one flankers i'm not sure and so I decided to take the plunge and just get it and see what it's all about. I really love the bottle. I think that was the first attraction. But anyways, let's go ahead. So in terms of the original structure of this perfume, the top notes have some fruitiness. So there's pear, there's blackberry, there's... um red berries in the mid there's some coffee red rose violet and then at the base there is some tonka bean amber some woodiness some patchouli and ambergris so i mean if i were to look at this from what i smell the opening is definitely fruity i definitely get some fruitiness in the opening it smells like some berries of course there's a hint of something plasticky something slightly artificial and these days i'm just like the way i i am these days i just i've i've made up my mind that with middle eastern fragrances or with some dupes you're going to get something that feels artificial i mean it's a dupe it's not an original so i'm not expecting the world all right so i'm i'm learning to kind of manage my expectations when it comes to dupes either way I get some fruitiness and some sweetness in the opening. So obviously, they have tried to recreate a fruity, sweet accord in the opening. And then as I get to the mid, I kind of smell something like, I don't know how to call it. There's a floral in the middle and I smell a white floral. Now, I don't know what white floral is. It smells like jasmine to me but here i'm seeing that there's freesia and all that but it smells like jasmine to me either way just know that there's a white floral accord in the middle of that fruitiness there's also some woodiness and all that now i'm waiting to see if i can smell the coffee i cannot really smell outright coffee but i can tell you that i smell something rosy and something lipsticky which is like the iris i cannot really get a clear coffee accord but i get the powderiness of the iris and that lip lipsticky nature of iris and i get of course a clear rose accord and i also get something like an amber when this finally dries down so in terms of how this transitions it starts off being fruity and sweet goes into a white floral and then ends up in an ambery powdery irisy type of scent that's what this is first impressions but i'm going to give you an update when i've used this in detail let me know if you have solamente am i pronouncing it correctly it's from maison alhambra it's supposed to be duping one of you know the dolce and gabbana either the one or the only ones let me know what you think if you have this and till i see you again on another video enjoy the rest of your day or night i'm going to come to you with a more detailed review when i've used this in detail take care bye